Hey guys, good morning. Always sweating over here. I just was in the kids' villa uh, working on the uh, the beds. We got some nice some nice videos coming up. Uh, nice construction videos coming up for the kids' villa. Um, we're gonna focus on that for a few videos for a little while, um, just because it's a it's, that's gonna be a long process. Not a long process, but I think there's a I think there's a lot lot to lot to see there. So um, if you get bored of the kids' villa videos, make making the making the beds, let me know. Um, so I'm in our room. It's our couch, just a bunch of junk on it right now. Um, we're heading over to Taliban. Well, we're gonna talk to the priest over there. And um, I wanna show you the closet. The, the closet's finished. It just has to be um, clear coated. Um, but we still put our things in it and then we'll probably have to take them all out. But take a look at the closet. Girl. Wow, baby, mm. it looks so posh. Do you know what posh means? Uh, it means I don't know. I think it means like classy. You know, you look, you look very elegant, posh. You know. Mm. I think at first you thought the girl wasn't helping you. <laughs> what? That girl call me posh. I'll kick her ass. No, baby, it's a compliment. <laughs> so guys, look at. So this is our closet. Sorry, it's a little messy because we're still we're still packing, unpacking things, and organizing. But take a look at this closet. And we still gotta get hand handles on this right here. Um, so this is, we still have to put a, uh, a molding across the top so you can't see the track. But this door weighs a ton. And it's, so it slides back and forth. So you can see that this is my side. My sneakers all have to be washed. Hey, how did these end up on my side? Put them on your side. <laughs> I only have this one little room. How about mine? It's small too. They're filthy from being over at the other house. They, when, when the girl comes back, cleaning girl, she's gonna have to wash all my sneakers. And then look at, she has her side. Look at her side. What my side is so small. It's already packed. Mm. Uh -huh. Still have a lot of clothes that the kids feel their daddy. A lot of clothes, where are you going to put, put them? I don't know. We have to make hangers. We have to make another one. Not one like this, but a, we make another closet in the kids' room, but a cheaper one. Just, just you know, just with just a hanger. That's it. And a couple of shelves. No doors. Nothing like that. I'm going to wear this for my wedding. Okay. We wore those last night. It was fun. Ding, 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 ding. Just kidding, guys. <laughs> we didn't. I don't know if I had seen them, I probably would have said, yeah, but one. So this has to be clear coated, sanded a little bit more. Uh, baby, you're in my video, I'm trying to make a closet video. Hmm? I'm trying to make a closet video, you're in the middle of it. Sorry. Um, so I couldn't find a figure out way to put my rods. Look where they are. <laughs> <laughs> no, because because the, the baby can, they still has hooks on them. I, you know, I don't want the baby to get hooked on. Otherwise she'll be having open heart surgery with those hooks. So you got drawers, 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 drawers. And I want to show people my side, if you can just get out of the way for five minutes. We, we got it. Okay, no. yeah. Sorry for the interruption, guys. It's just so rude. What's rude? Me? No. Okay, so this, this side has been done. Oh, we also have a plug inside there that Neri hopefully will come back and put up the LED lights in here so we have lighting inside the closet. Um, so this is my drawer. Okay, see so it comes out. Nice big drawer. I have my underwear, my sweatshirts, all my t-shirts, all my socks. And that's it. I don't really have any. I've got some shirts in the other room that I'll bring over here. Just a couple, but honestly, I don't wear them. Um, if you come to the Philippines, and, I mean, if you're the type of guy you like to wear college shirts all the time, I mean, I can't tell you what to wear, but me, I don't want to wear college shirts in the Philippines. But these drawers are so heavy. So these are my, this is my other drawer. I got my shorts, my bathing suit. I've got 
Um, just my bad pajamas, and some other t-shirts, some extra t-shirts that didn't fit in the other other drawer. Um, and then Lynn has her stuff. Look at Lynn's stuff. Nice and neat, huh? Isn't it great? <laughs> Having these drawers. Hopefully we won't get any bugs inside here. I sprayed everything. And we treated everything with selignum, so we'll see. Um, and, and then, so, I slide this drawer over. Slide, the, slide that over, and then look at, huh? This is, it's beautiful, huh? Isn't it beautiful? And then if you come over here, so I don't know what one has in this drawer, but let's see. So more stuff. And then this this part's all done. You just gotta this is all clear coated. I want people to really see what a great job. This is all handmade, including this door. So the, <coughs> this door Although it looks like this one, um, this one you need two people to carry. This one, just one person can carry. That's the difference. This one we made. Um, this whole closet, everything you see here, was all made by hand. Every piece, including the rack. So, we gotta get some handles for this guy. And then, voila! Look at huh? it's, not it's not done. It's not done yet. Well, look at, isn't that great? And you just got all this storage. And then up there you'll see there's an outlet so we can run some wiring in here for lights inside there. We'll get to that at the very, very end. Uh, right now, that's the least of my worries. But, Guys, they're not used to work with, working with these types of uh, uh, brackets, so they don't really know. It, no, but but they did the best. They did the best they could, and I'm I'm happy with it. I really. And that's it. So this is a nice sliding door, my little octopusy. But I can't get it, I don't know, it didn't come with a very good mount, you know, it just slides. I don't know how to, I don't know how to um, permanently attach it there because of the way the, the bracket is in the back. Not crazy about that length, but we stuck it up there anyways. And then there should be a full length mirror here eventually. And then this closet is complete. Um, so here's a, here's a quick scan of the room. Um, we still have to get curtains. So what we decided with the curtains, because the blinds, although they're nice to have blinds here, it's very expensive to get really nice wooden blinds. These are such big windows. Um, it's a little bit more affordable to get um, uh, a curtain that goes across the whole thing. Um, and so what we'll do is we'll we're gonna have to, if these curtains do expand this rod holder, but I'm not sure it goes the whole length. So we might have to get uh, one, two, three new rod holders, and we'll use these rod holders in the other rooms. Um, but what we're, what we're probably gonna do is get curtains made. There'll be four panels, uh, a panel here, panel here, panel here, and a panel here. So this way, when you wanna open and close the curtains, you don't have to swing the whole thing open, the whole thing closed. So let's say, Let's say you just want to open the windows here, but keep these curtains closed. There's a panel here, so all you have to do is go, and that's it. You got a window, all right? Same thing here. If you want to just open this, and then that's it. Then you can keep these closed if you wanted, because each each window each window will have its own panel. So there'll be one, two, three, four, four panels, and that's what we're going to do here for the room as soon as we get around to it. <coughs> when they're done with the kids' villa, they're gonna make nightstands, one here, one there. And then after that, after the nightstands, they'll be on to the uh, kitchen to make the couch. 
Uh, once the couch is made, then we will go ahead and order the foam in the material that will probably be just like this. Um, so you'll have, we'll have these types of cushions on the uh, couch in the, um, in the kitchen, but it will be much nicer. So that's it. I like my new sheets. Got these at Mandawi Foam, but nothing here is really great quality, even though it's not cheap. So that's it, it's our messy room. Um, I need to get in the shower before she kills me. I have to get to uh, Taliban. I think overall, oh, we also need a small refrigerator to go next to the um, water cooler. And that's it. We're so, we're so close. This one is so close to be put up, to be put on Airbnb. And um, you know, I don't, I don't know what will happen. We're gonna list this on Airbnb. I think for fifty dollars a night, including breakfast. Um, I'm really not interested in making people lunch and dinner. Um, if they insist on having lunch and dinner, it's not going to be cheap. I can tell you that much. Uh, it's not a hotel. I mean, we don't, this is not a hotel. It's just an Airbnb rental. Uh, and if you look on Airbnb, not, not many, unless, unless, there are some hotels here in Ando that advertise on Airbnb, like Ando White Beach, I think, and a few others. And obviously those are real hotels. They have breakfast, they have a menu, they have restaurants. But we don't have a restaurant here, and we're not a hotel. So Airbnb, uh, we, we, we're doing the breakfast, and that's, that's it. You know, it's nice to have a breakfast included. People can get their day started with a breakfast, and then they're off. You know, they can have lunch in the town, have dinners in their resorts, and that's it. But um, if we really had to make someone lunch and dinner, it's not going to be not going to be cheap because I really I really don't want to do it. Um, we're not a, we're not set up or equipped, equipped really for that, but we can we can do it. We can make special arrangements, and you know us that if we're gonna cook a lunch and a dinner for someone, it's gonna be uh, the freshest ingredients uh, that you can find anywhere here on the island. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Um, we really appreciate all the great comments that we've been getting lately. Um, so good luck, good, uh, good luck to us with the, uh, the wedding plans and we'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, keep an eye out for the, uh, construction of the kids' villa. Those are going to be, uh, probably one video almost every day will be just about the kids, the kids' villa, uh, cause there's a lot going on there. So thanks guys. See you. See you soon.